If you are new here, this is my 2011 Camaro. Um, the hood, I'll tell you about my experience with the company and everything like that. So I'm gonna show you guys like a point of view video. We'll do some polls, duh. What's up guys, my name is Raquel. If you don't know who I am, welcome to my channel. I am so pale, so disregard and my t-shirt tan line what is that oh my god okay so i get a lot of questions about my hood now this is my if you don't know if you are new here this is my 2011 camaro um the hood i'll tell you about my experience with the company and everything like that but so the hood is a three inch carbon fiber cow hood um do i believe it's really three inches no it is like five, it feels like, in all honesty. But I'll show you guys a, diff a couple angles so you guys can get a idea. Um, this is from the front. <laughs> it cuts like half the windshield off. <laughs> but, yeah, my car's a little bit dirty. I don't know if you could tell in the video or not, but yeah. Oh my god, that was weird. Okay. Wow, I'm like really red. So, I got the hood from BMC. If you've been around and you saw me do the install, I talk about it there. Um, I got the hood from BMC. They buy from Anderson. Um, before I say what happened, I will never represent a company. I'm always going to be honest if I don't like them. I will only represent a company if I truly like them um, but there's companies that tried to like work with me and I don't believe in it or I don't like it or you know I'm never gonna do anything for the money or if they're gonna treat me differently because followers versus someone that doesn't um, so I'm always gonna be completely honest with how I feel I just want to say that right now um if i do work work with a company it's because i've tried the product i like it or i've seen it in person um if a company reaches out and wants to work with me i've never tried the product i'll be like send it and i will i will ask them if i can be completely honest i don't want to do anything for just money or anything like that and i don't want to represent a company to get you guys to buy it and then it's shit you know um but for instance, I, so I reached out to the rag company. I love their products. I said, do you guys want to do a video? Send me some products. I will do a video. They're going to just send me a random box of pretty much everything to clean the outside with. But it's what I, I love their products. So I'm going to represent them. Um, that's why I don't work with a lot of chemical guys and Adam polishes and stuff. It's, I like some of their products, but I don't like all of them. And... I don't know I'm just really obsessed with everything from the rag company so I want to work with them so with Anderson and BMC um, basically it took like six to seven months to get the hood when I finally got the hood um, it was the wrong hood so then a couple weeks later they finally sent the right hood and then after emailing and emailing and trying to get answers and trying to get answers and they didn't know and I understand things were on back order but they were just so, I felt so like I had to keep like reaching out and it wasn't them telling me. Um, basically Anderson was blaming on BMC and BMC was blaming on Anderson and they weren't just honest and I don't know whose fault that was but it was just kind of like shitty. And then after dealing with all of that, they offered me a $100 gift card to BMC. The only thing that I could buy there was like cup holder inserts. I'm like whatever it was just extremely annoying the hood came with um so on top of waiting that long and everything like that um the hood came with swirl marks the entire thing was swirl marks i had to get it professionally paint corrected and then obviously i got it ceramic coated so i couldn't ceramic coat it until i got paint corrected the swirl marks were so bad on it like it's whatever but besides that and dealing with all of that and 
offered me a hundred dollar gift card and then I was like seriously um I basically told them to F off and they left me on red and didn't answer so I don't know that was probably a year or so ago that I got the hood no I don't know how long I've had this hood I don't, I'll put it on the screen of how long I've had it but yeah it's been that long and they still haven't answered so it's whatever um so do I recommend it not really sure I actually I really do love the hood I really love the hood no other company sells this style hood so it's like if you want to deal with that and wait that long um, it didn't have to do with the COVID thing because I saw reviews and they said their customer service is bad on both ends and that you have to, um, that you're going to wait a long time. Now, these are just my opinions. Take it as you want to. Um, if you want to get the hood, I, I really do love the hood. I just hated what I had to deal with. Um, it said that it wouldn't take the money out of my bank account until they shipped it or until it processed. But they took it out the first day. So I was like, okay, whatever. But, yeah. So basically, they both blamed it on each other. But they both sent me screenshots of... I don't know what the communication was. If my order just never went through. But until I posted it on Instagram on my story, that's when they came back around. So, take that as you want. Um, but I do love the hood. So, you can't... I guess you can't get it all. So, I'm going to show you guys, like, a point of view video. We'll do some polls. Duh. Um, but I'm not going to put it on my head. I I did it before, and I didn't like it because it was moving, and it was too high, and it was just weird. I'm going to put the GoPro, like, right here. But so you guys can see what I see. Now, I am five foot two, and I'm fine <laughs> with driving it. Um, I am, like, a little like this a lot. But, yeah. Six hours later. Uh, so, yeah. Um, I tried to use my GoPro and it kept, like, it would be, like, really white and it wouldn't focus. It was too bright outside. And then it started raining and then it was really freaking hot out. So, I was like, I'm just going to go home for a little bit. And then I ended up falling asleep. So, now it's, like, 7.30. So, I changed and... Thank <laughs> you. 